It's actually pretty funny because everybody says, well, you know, we're the fire department, we're the ambulance service, everybody knows us. They don't. They see you go by, uh, they see the lights and siren, uh, and then they turn around, they, they look and they watch, and that's the end of it. Most community folks don't understand whether we're funded by tax dollars, donations, combination. They see a pancake breakfast now and again in some of the volunteer departments. They don't know what we're capable of. They don't know the difference between ALS and BLS. They don't know any of those things unless we tell them. And we don't do a good job of telling them. We just tell them, call 911, we'll come. So when it comes time for asking for equipment, for asking for support, for expanding the scope of service, everybody thinks it looks like TV. You know, there's a paramedic on every ambulance. You hang up the phone after you call 911 and there's a helicopter hovering over your head. And in most cases, none of that's true, but we have to tell them what it is we're capable of doing. Um, and we are selling something, we're selling ourselves. There are, all the way along, direct response marketing, which is sending something out, getting someone to take action and, and do what you want them to do. Direct response marketing has been around for years and there's ways to track where your sources of funding are coming from, where your leads are coming from, where your uh, website visits are coming from, uh, what piece of material is working based on sending them to different websites, asking them to put a put a, a, an extension or code on a piece of mailing uh, that, from an ad that's running on a radio. There's lots of ways to track that and that is something that we encourage. We don't want you to spend, and we don't want any of our clients to spend, I don't want to spend money on marketing that I can't track. So I want to know which marketing is working properly so that I can do more of that and less of something that's not. It can take a lot of time. Um, some of the larger departments have public information officers. Some people want to be trained as public information officers, which is something that we do. Um, but it doesn't have to take a lot of time. There's a lot of technology that's there. But some people just don't want to get involved. They want the results, they just don't want to get involved. So we have a, we've established a number of ways. We can train folks to do it. We can do it with them and coach them through it so they're trained to do it at the end. Uh, we can even do it for them, um, which I think is different. Most consulting companies or marketing companies um, don't have the capability to give three levels of service the way, the way we can. And so we have something for everybody. And it doesn't have to take a lot of time after you've put in the initial effort to craft your message properly and to really be able to tell the community what it is you want to tell them.